Welcome to City Update, I'm Sherry Kropp. Spring is in the air and we know that that means it's time for the Fayetteville Dogwood Festival. It's been a tradition here in downtown Fayetteville for more than 40 years. There's a lot that's going to be happening the last weekend in April and Jackie Tucky from the Dogwood Festival is going to give us all the details. We're so excited about our 42nd annual Fayetteville Dogwood Festival. Although the dogwoods have already bloomed, there's no end to the fun to be had that weekend. It'll be the 26th to the 28th of April. Um, we've got a lot going on that weekend. We have our street fair with um, 100 vendors that will be selling products that they've made or created. And we've got great fair food. Everybody likes to come out for the fair food. So plenty of that on the promenade in the parking lot behind the office building. Uh, in our park, we will be having knocker balls. We've got a an mobile escape room that is new actually to this state. So I think this is going to be a real treat for people. Operates like a like the permanent type, but it's mobile. It's a trailer. Of course, the Midway will be back. All the carnival rides um, for adults and mid-adults and youngsters. It will be on Mason, Ave Mason Street, right across from the park. You can't miss it. It's uh, partially in Linear Park and the Masonic Lodge parking lot. And I know he's gonna have um, plenty of rides and, and an awful lot of fun. The big Ferris wheel, uh, you name it, he's got it. On Friday night, we are especially pleased to have the 82nd Airborne Division All-American Rock Band on our stage from 6 to 9 p.m. This is probably a first for them to be at Dogwood Festival, and they're very excited about it, and we are too. Um, it's going to be a magical night, and we hope that everybody can come out and watch them. They're a fabulous band. I've heard them play before, and it's going to be a real treat for everybody. On Saturday, we are having music entertainment on the stage in Saturday afternoon and evening. I think everybody should check this out. Um, we've got a couple small bands that are coming out um, to assist with the entertainment for the weekend. And I know it's going to be, um, I know it'll be a lot of fun for people and something in the park that, you know, we're known for the music and we want to keep that tradition going. On Sunday, we are having a classic car cruise in. A couple of the car clubs in Fayetteville are coming down. They are classic cars and they will be on the 400 block of Hay Street on Sunday afternoon from noon to four. So that's a great addition to our lineup. We um, are really excited. A lot of the car owners are veterans and we are so pleased to have them with us. One thing I did want to mention is that Second Harvest Food Bank will be out on Saturday and they'll be on Ray Avenue near Husk Hardware. They're taking food donations for a few hours in the afternoon, so please come out and support the food bank. They really could use everyone's contributions. We want to make sure that everybody can come down to the Fayetteville Dogwood Festival this year. It's our 42nd annual, uh, and you don't want to be missing this. We do want to emphasize that it, there is no charge to come to the festival. The only money you need to spend is if you choose to buy food or from a craft vendor or ride the rides at the park. Everything else is free. There is no charge to attend the festival. And while you're down here having a great time, let me remind you that our hours on Friday are from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. On Saturday, we're open from noon to 9 p.m. And on Sunday, we are available here for a great time from noon to 6 p.m. For more information, please check out our Instagram page and our Facebook page. That will be um, as up to date as you can get these days. So be sure to mark your calendars for April 26th through the 28th for the Fayetteville Dogwood Festival. There's going to be tons of activities and it's sure to be a great weekend. I hope to see you out there. Thanks for joining me.